Osi Pharmaceuticals, we developed a pharmaceutical drug that is aimed at eliminating the, the need for reading glasses. That's a problem that about one and a half billion people around the world are suffering from. Currently, there are only reading glasses or contact lenses, and our product, which comes in the form of eye drops, is actually aimed at basically eliminating the need for that for so many people around the world. That area, more than probably any other technology, um, really needs strong patents to support um, innovation. I mean, so much money and time and resources go into developing a pharmaceutical product and they really need strong patent protection. Um, in that area, the law is, is really changing rapidly right now. Um, there's a lot of discussion about patentable subject matter and really certain claims that people in the past would have thought were um, definitely covering innovations are now being held to be not patentable subject matter um, simply because they're natural processes or new innovations and so that's something that's really evolving. I do a lot of um, client counseling. I work with some smaller companies and some new startups um, that are developing some chemical entities and working with some larger pharmaceutical companies as well. I spend a lot of time in the courtroom litigating patents for innovator companies um, and I think once you see um, how patents can be litigated or you know, issues that come up in the courtroom, I think that really helps with knowing how to write stronger patents for companies. I think you know a lot more once you see how they're attacked on how to draft claims that would be less susceptible to certain attacks. Mm -hmm.